It's a long way to the top, but some climbers see it as a challenge. The main Bound Adventure Center opened up in 2001. Since then, people have been coming here seven days a week to practice their bouldering and rock climbing skills alike. Andrew Krauss is the manager of the gym. Uh, so bouldering is done um, anywhere from 10 to 12 feet off the ground, and there's a pad underneath you, so if you fall, you just fall onto the soft pad. Um, and it's usually a lot harder than roped climbing. Krauss says that anywhere from 800 to 1,000 people come here every week. Drew Northup comes to the gym frequently. There's a lot less involved in terms of planning, but you still do need to know where your handholds and your footholds are and where you're going to rest and stuff like that. Mia and Lun Sawyer came all the way from Mount Desert Island. For them, it's a different way to work out. You know, if I'm chasing a ball or climbing, so if I have that goal, I can exercise. But if I'm just jogging, I'm just lifting weights for no apparent reason, I just, I don't know, I can't do it. For some, though, bouldering isn't just to stay in shape. So your friends can just kind of get together and, you know, you can talk a lot too and just boulder and it's a good conversation stimulator. Every Thursday, the main Bound Adventure Center is open to the public for $2. For Nezcom Connection, I'm Calvin Cutler.